Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com here coming at you with 2021 Leaf Metal Draft Football Hobby Edition plus 2020 Plates and Patches. It's a dual case break featuring 99 hits. Are there really going to be that many hits? I guess so. I guess every hit in Leaf Metal Draft's an autograph and there's a ton of hits in Plates and Patches. So yeah, some great value here, ladies and gentlemen. So thank you everyone for getting in. Um, looks like, yeah, these are all basically, most of it's hits. So all cards will ship. Let's get this done. Big thanks to everybody who bought their spots straight up. And congrats again to the people who won their spots. No, my relationship with Adam's in. Just buy spots straight up, Adam, next time. Don't do those fillers. Those fillers, they're not worth it. Buying a spot straight up is worth it. You guarantee yourself a spot. There's all the 32 teams right here. That, I'd rather just do it the old-fashioned way and not have any of those mini breaks. But people seem to like them. But I always steer people towards just get, get spots straight up. Avoid the heartache. Guarantee yourself a spot. Pay a little extra, guarantee yourself a spot. Two and a six, eight times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. And two and a six, eight times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. All right, two and a six, eight times. There's eight times. There's eight times. We got the Lions down to the Ravens. All right, good luck, everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I know this took a minute or two to fill, but it's a little, little pri on the pricey side. But we finally got it done. People saw the value in it. I appreciate it. People won spots too. That helps too. Stephen K with the Lions. Stephen Wright with the Jets. Chris Maxwell with the Cardinals. And Chris just bought five spots in that Series 2 we were talking about before I started this video. Bengals for Anthony. Jonathan with the Niners. Anthony with the Bills. Robert with the Seahawks. Andrew with the Colts. Chris with the Raiders. My Raiders. The Buccaneers and the Broncos, my rivals. Sean with the Packers, Chris with the Titans, Sean Robinson with the two different Sean's. Sean O, Sean R, Sean R with the Pats, Kyle with the Texans, John with the Chargers, Anthony with the Cowboys, Aaron with the Rams, Chris with the Chiefs, uh, James with the Jaguars, Anthony with the Dolphins, Jonathan with the Washington football team, Aaron with the Browns, Chris with the Saints, Sean O with the Giants, Chris with the Panthers, and with the spot that you won, Bears, Jonathan with the Vikings, Anthony with the Steelers, Daniel with the Eagles, and Jordan with the Baltimore Ravens. All right, let's alphabetize by team name. And we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. Then we'll have the break. Stick around. BRB. All right, welcome back, folks. There's a lot of trades happening here. So there's a lot to unpack. So let's start with the first trade, which was the Vikings-Washington football team trade. So Jonathan is out of the Vikings spot and into the WFT spot. Jonathan L is out of that spot and is now in the Vikings spot. We'll put a T next to there so we know that's, part, that's a trade. There is another deal here with Jonathan L. Jonathan L is now in the Chief spot. Right there. And Chris is now in that Niners spot. On. Control X, Control V. There we go. And we'll put a lowercase t there for trade so we know that those two are related. Another deal was done where both the Buccaneers and the Titans were traded for the Steelers. So Chris is out of the Buccaneers Steelers spot, or Buccaneers Titans spot, into the Steelers spot here. We'll put a little plus sign there saying it's a, it's a trade. And now Anthony gets two teams, gets the Buccaneers and the Titans. There you go. So there's a, there's a lot going on here. All right, let's print and rip. Sorry, Steve, trade window was closed a couple minutes before your comment. Oh yeah, he sees it now. 
All right, so with all that being set, let's print this out and let's rip this up. So here's how it shakes out in this dual case break. So most of the list remains the same. Jonathan got that last spot mojo. And with that, he traded that. So lowercase t's are related. So there was that trade right there. Uppercase t's right there were traded. And the plus signs were traded right here. That was a two for one deal. All right, so there's plates and patches right there, 12 boxes. Did you wanna, should we open the trade window back up again, Steve Wright? I haven't even opened these. I mean, we don't, we don't usually have this many trades, so this is kind of exciting. Do you guys wanna do a trade? Video clock is running on the video. <laughs> Yeah, Jets Bear, because I think Steve Steve is a Bears guy, and Chris is a, uh, a Jets guy. So we'll open it back up. Hollywood, do you have a better offer? I don't know if you're going to have a better offer, because Steve actually wants the Bears. And Chris has the Bears, and he wants the Jets, which Steve Wright has. Sorry, Jonathan. All right, so I'll do it. Yeah, I don't think Chris is going to do Washington for the Bears. All right, so trade window back. This is unprecedented, folks. So trade window open. Well, I mean, yeah, the, these guys are getting the teams that they want. All they have to do is do a little switch. So let's take Chris out of the out of the bear spot. My keyboard is working here. What the hell's going on here? All right, so Chris is out of the bear spot. He doesn't want the bears. Steve Wright wants the bears. And Chris, so they're basically switching their PC teams, which is easy, which I can accommodate. I wouldn't do this if this wasn't your guys' PC teams, but they are, so and it's a simple it's a simple switch. Alright. Well let's see how it works out. Alright, yeah, the guys kind enough to apologize for the hold up. Yeah, thanks for everyone's everyone's patience there. I mean I rarely do trades, or the trades rarely happen, so now it's kind of a treat when trades are actually happening, so. All right, so let's go, let's go back to 2020 first. So we're gonna do 2020 plates and patches first, then we'll do the present with the uh, 2021 set. Right there. All right, everyone remembers what 2020 was all about. Goff was on the front. And we got Phoenix at Denver just starting up. The Sixers comfortably beat the uh, Hawks a little bit earlier in the first game. It's been a pretty good, exciting playoffs here. 
All right, now every box has a train whistle, right? There's the Marlin Mac. Oh, where did my list go? There you go. So Marlin Mac, Andrew, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. There's everyone. You can see the uh, rooftop sign that I made right here. So Jets right there, Bears right up there. And we've got, is this, uh, it's LT, Ladanian Tomlinson. Eight out of 25 LT, Chargers edition. Going to John, Jonathan L, and the Chargers. Different Jonathan L. We've got two different Jonathan L's. we got Jonathan Leon Takanakos, and then we got Jonathan Liang here too. There's Alex Smith for Washington. That's to 65, and your hits. There's Brian Edwards. Double coverage, dual relic for my Raiders. 40 out of 50 on that. That's gonna go to Chris Maxwell and my Raiders. Never got a season to gear last year, so hopefully this year. Then we got a nice Chase Young. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. One out of 35 for your Defensive Rookie of the Year. Jonathan Arnaldi with the Washington football team. Which he got in a trade. Nice dual relic. An autograph. The rare Chase Young autograph in the wild. So Jonathan draws first blood in that Washington-Minnesota trade. Let's see if we can even it out for Jonathan Liang. Next group here, we got Terrell Suggs, Cyan for Anthony and the Titans. Check that. Ravens, they're playing the Titans. Ravens, Jordan, K, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. There's old legend Paul Warfield. When are the Browns going to bring that logo back? Aaron with Cleveland. We've got Keyshawn Vaughn, rookie card to 99. And Canton Cloth, Bob Lilly, 43 out of 75, two color patch. Old cowboy going to Anthony G. And a Marquee Marks, Marquee Mark? Marquee Marks, 22 out of 25, Richard Sherman on card autograph for the Niners. Chris Maxwell drawing first blood in that Niners Chiefs deal. Next, Patrick Mahomes, my homies, plate for the Chiefs. Jonathan, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Nice, my homies. There's James Morgan to 60 for Chris's Jets. There's Tiki Barber to 65 for their housemates, the Giants, Sean. Clyde Edwards E. Lair. Rookie Reflections Dual Relic. Some nice color up there. 13 out of 99. Jonathan with the Chiefs. And the autograph is Fletcher Cox. 10 out of 50. Eagles. Daniel. With the Fly Eagles Fly. I agree, Chris Maxwell. The plates and patches is pretty underrated. Good combination of nice colors in the windows and the relics. Some mostly on-card autographs. They're, 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 they distribute out some old school, old school guys pretty nicely along with the younger guys. 
So it's a good balance. All right, we got Arden Key for the Raiders. That'll be for Chris. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. A lot of train whistles. I got to spread that energy around. Stephon Diggs, 40 out of 60 for the Bills. Anthony. You got Kenyon Drake to 65 for the Cardinals. Chris. Full coverage. Oh, that's nice. 23 out of 80. Full coverage, two-color relic. T. Higgins. It's Anthony G. with the Cincinnati Bengals. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll find the guy that, that throws him the ball. And we've got Marquis Marks, Kenyon Drake. 75 out of 99. It's on the Raiders now. Raiders kind of gave him a surprising contract, but he's pretty solid. I would have rather that money go to the defenses side of the ball, but I guess we'll try to just outscore everybody. Le'Veon, Jets edition, going to Chris Maxwell, whoop, whoop. all aboard the Big A Express. I thought that Le'Veon Bell relationship with the Jets was going to work out a lot, a lot more nicely, but it just didn't. Maybe that's more, more Adam Gase than anything. There's Matthew Stafford to 25, still Lions edition here. For Stephen K. There's Cole Komet, double coverage, dual relic, 85 out of 99. I actually am not. I'm watching the the playoff basketball game, Jonathan. What's happening with the Dodgers? I guess it's on commercial. I could be switching back and forth. Rangers at something special happening? Wow, the Dodgers already have 6 nothing in the first inning, and they're already warming up the bullpen. Steve Wright with the Bears. And back here is Jake from State Farm. Two-color patch and autograph. Three out of ten. Wow. Three home runs in the first inning. Muncie, Turner, and Lux. Right, I think that's... Uh, J AJ Pollock pokes one through. Uh, Buffalo Bills, Anthony G. Yeah, that's what I. That, that's what Le'Veon Bell himself said, right, Chris? Like he was just like I just wasn't used. <laughs> Gase never even. <laughs> yeah, Chris Maxwell's like Gase. Gase never even tried to use him at what he's good at. Very. Uh, yeah, no, no, yeah. Steve Wright, I couldn't have said it better myself. Gase is a fool. <laughs> Very baffling. There's Jerry Rice. Magenta plate for the Niners. That's going to be for Chris. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Yeah, he might. I mean, yeah, he might be one of the. He might be one of the worst head coaches in recent memory. That's for sure. For someone who's gotten, I mean, he was decent in Miami, but it's it's hard, I guess. <laughs> I've never coached a football team, so I wouldn't know. I'm assuming head coaching is just a different animal. There's Joe Burrow, double coverage, dual relic. Some guys are just great coordinators, but maybe just not good head coaches. Anthony G with the Bengals. And behind Alex Smith is Jalen Ragor, upper echelon autograph. 66 out of 75, another one for the Eagles. Daniel.
And there's Alex Smith for Washington. Oh, come on, Mookie. <laughs> you don't play Willie Mays at catcher. Yeah, what was the point of getting Le'Veon Bell up? Oh, sorry about that. You got Jameis Winston, Buccaneers edition for Anthony. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. There's Jalen Hurts. 14 out of 60 for the Fly Eagles Fly for Daniel. There's Denzel Mims for the Jets. Nice patch trio. Now with some new coaching, with a new quarterback, Denzel Mims showed some flashes of brilliance. Chris Maxwell. Now that they've got him, Corey Davis, I think, is on that team now, who's a solid receiver. There's some weapons on there now. And there's Justin Tucker. Eight out of 30. What's going on there? Oh, that's that's his number. It's a family show. Jordan with the Ravens. And 67 out of 70, Aaron Rodgers. <laughs> Mike Bobby in the house. He's saying Gase was better than cocaine Wayne Fonts for Detroit. Was was Fonts fond of the uh, of the Colombian marching powder? I mean, I don't want to get I don't want to get sued for like hearsay or anything like that. There's Matt Ryan, Falcons, Andrew with the Falcons, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Mm. Chris Maxwell, Jets fan, is concerned that the whole Jets wide receiving core of wide receivers. To 60, there's Jeff Saturday. He got caught with it in his car and then blamed his son? <laughs> 31 out of 99, two-color patch, Canton Cloth. Bob Lilly. Dodger scored six runs in the first. <laughs> okay. Well, <good>. <laughs> <laughs> At least that makes me happy. Oh, wait, no. No, no it doesn't. doesn't. That's right. It does not. Dallas Cowboys <laughs> with Anthony, for Anthony G. There's Henry Ruggs, upper echelon autograph. 6 U.S. 75. You know what my favorite, I know it's a family show, but we get PG-13 sometimes. You know what my favorite uh, coach cocaine story is? Um, uh, you know what I'm talking about. Texas Rangers. No. Uh, yeah, Rangers. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ron Washington, yeah. Oh, who's best. a great coach. The he, best. But, but like, he was... I, I don't know if he got caught with it or something. But, it, he, I mean, first of all, he was, like, in his 60s. Yeah. Like, early 60s when he got caught with it. And then he was just like, oh, I was just trying it. I was like, come on, no no, no six-year-old well, here's, tries. Here's, here's the better part of all. There's problem. Henry Ruggs. You know, the, uh, for his... Chris. Like, my Raiders. His retirement, they gifted him like a 1970s Cadillac. I was like, that guy does cocaine. <laughs> like, that guy does cocaine like all the time. Come on. Like everyone knows it. Yeah. But it, it just made it seem like he just picked it up at a party. Like I don't know. at 65 years old. He's like, I guess now's the time for me to try it. It's like, no, sir. This is, you in, you just you enjoy it. Didn't, uh, didn't, what's his name from Home Improvement get busted with a shit ton of cocaine? Or was it, was it marijuana? Um, Tim Allen? Yeah. I don't know. I mean, doesn't, I know he doesn't, got busted back in the doesn't day surprise me. Stuff. Willie Aikens cocaine scandal in I don't remember Willie Aikens. Ron Washington's I thought was pretty funny. I love though. Ron Washington. <laughs> Just the yeah. first time I did it. <laughs> There's Denzel Mims again. Chris, you want confiscated bong from Michael Douglas? I like that. There's Mims again, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Come on, Michael Douglas. 
You have someone else hold that for you. Mike Vrabel. <laughs> Isn't that Kirk? Um, remember, remember um, Chris Carter at the rookie, like like the rookie orientation, where he said he basically said to the rookies, make sure you have a fall guy. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh man. Or just just don't do it. <laughs> well, that. But at the same point, at least Chris Carter actually said the shit that they need to hear. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. There's Jalen Hurts, two color dual relic. Oh, Aikens was actually trafficking on team flights. That's for Daniel. That sucks. Eagles, that's for Daniel. And Michael Pippen Jr. Two color dual relic and autographed 99. Former uh, so USC guy? Yeah. Pippen? Yeah. For the blue horseshoes, Andrew. Amon Ross St. Brown got uh, invited to Panini's uh, Pro Day. The, um, Rookie, Rookie premiere? Premier. When is that happening? I don't know, but it's a third round it, pick. Big time, big deal. I wonder if if it's open to the public now. Maybe they're doing it later so they can have it open to the public. Maybe. It's usually in LA. Maybe they're doing it after June 15th. I think that's awesome. There was a, I gotta figure out who it was. There was an ex-angel that used to live in Anaheim Hills. Where his house, he had a batting cage and everything outside. Joshua Kelly, one of one. His house got raided because he was connected with cocaine. And they, like, there was, like, they found cocaine everywhere. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. For John. For John Leon and the Chargers. What was the train whistle? I mean, the, the wooden whistle for the plates. I guess I should have done the wooden whistle for the plates, right? Help save my voice? Yeah. Cam Newton. This place, one per yeah, it's one per It's a lot. Yeah. Double coverage. T. Higgins again, 18 out of 99. Oh, we were on a commercial. I could have changed back to the basketball game. 13 out of 30, Marquise Goodwin. It's another one for the Niners. That's for Chris. And Ezekiel Elliott. So did they pull a Tony out of the game? So he, that's the thing. is He then proceeded to stay in the batter's box, uh -huh. hit a double for an RBI, uh -huh. then stays on second, uh -huh. and then Upton scored him, or somebody okay, scored so him. Okay, so he's running the bases. So he ran, but he, like, he limped through the oh. plate, and I'm like, what are you doing? Then he went into the bolt, uh, into the dugout, and they were, like, checking it out, and he was showing uh -huh. his translator, Ipe, and the, and the trainer, uh -huh. and they took him in. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm like, I'm like, one, if that's his plant leg, come on. Put a pinch runner out there. Yes. Like, what are you doing? Damn, call up Joe Adele. <laughs> Marlon Davidson, one of one for the ATL. Andrew, all aboard the Big Hit Express. <laughs> Heinz Ward to 60. Who was the hockey player that ran into a Tim Hortons when he was drunk? Someone ran into a hockey player at Tim Hortons? No, a hockey player was uh, when he was driving. Drunk. Oh, and he and ran, ran, in, ran, into ran his Hortons. car into a Tim yeah, Hortons? Which is the most Canadian thing ever. Love that. All right, and then put, like, gravy on his french fries? Britt Reed, that's a sad story. Um, 37 out of 50, Canton Cloth, Randy Moss, Vikings, Jonathan and Liang with that. Anyone remember that hockey player? There's Darrington Evans, 43 out of 99. Oh, is Britt Reed, Andy Reed's son, Britt Reed? Oh, yeah, that's a terrible story. I think the crazy thing is, let me, I don't know if it's that crazy or not. There's Anthony with the Titans, by the way. Is that all accounts is that Andy Reed is like a wonderful person. Oh, yeah. 
and like I think both of his sons have gotten into issues. Didn't one of them die? Oh yeah, maybe. I'm pretty sure the one overdosed and died. So I don't know. There's some there's some, there's some demons in that that Reed family. Um, same with the what about the dude from uh, is it the Red Sox announcer? His son. I know the Red Sox announcer's son. Oh, that's a shitty one too. Anybody? Uh, yeah, Garrett Reed, I think, is the one that died. That's terrible. Jarvis Landry, Browns, one of one. Aaron Billingsley with Cleveland. All aboard the Big Hit Express. <laughs> oh, Remy, that's the one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Adam knows. Remy? Yeah. The hockey player? No, no, no. Remy's the, the uh, Red Sox. Oh, the Red Sox. Yeah. All right, that's to 25. Uh, Freddie, is the baseball mixer going on tonight? Yes. 50 out of 50, we got Jacob Eason, double coverage for the Blue Horseshoes. That's going to be for Andrew. Jerry Remy. And we've got a linebacker, Patrick Willis, 1 out of 10, highly revered autograph. Well, I would say, Cleveland, this is for you, but I'm pretty sure that Aaron Billingsley is a Ravens fan. So I don't think he's too thrilled about having the Browns randomized to him in this break. It makes it easy to sell him, though. Yeah, it makes it easy to sell. All right. So Sean is here. He's going to help me with... Here, we'll do a quick plates and patches recap right here, too. Here's, here's Remy. Jared works for the Red Sox. So his son... This is, a, um, this is Jerry Remy, right? Uh... Jared, Richard your son, Trent. worked for the Red Sox as a security guard and was fired in 2008 after another guard told the state police that Jared had stole, sold, that sold him steroids. On oh August, my god, yeah, don't on sell August, steroids. On August 16, 2013, Jared was arrested in a fatal stabbing of his girlfriend. Jeez. Yeah. Oh, that's uh, not good. Pleaded guilty. Uh, Jared was sentenced to life in state prison without the possibility of parole. Wow, that's terrible. Um, in 2010... Jordan, his other son, was charged with indecent assault and battery. Jenna was arrested in, on July. His daughter was arrested on July 25th, oh 2013, for disorderly conduct, assault and battery with a dangerous weapon, resisting arrest, wanton malicious oh. defacement, and misdemeanor break and entry. After she broke into her ex-boyfriend's house. So basically, he's having a great, great time with his kids. <laughs> Brutal. Right. It's just like that's rough. Cool. All right. Leaf Metal Draft. Now, Sean is going to help me out. Do you want to look him up? No, I, I got her. I can look it up pretty quickly here. I'm just going to hand it to you. Okay. And um, for those of you watching live, here's the checklist in the chat. That's what we're going to go by. So I'm going to rip these open. We're going to call them out who they are. Sean's going to tag them, and that's going to make this last part of the break go fairly quickly so we can dive right into the next break. Oh, that Marv Albert one's the best. Yeah. I love that. I mean, that's tame compared to some of, some of these... I mean, he paid her, though. Yeah, the, the, compared to the other guys, though. I mean, yeah. there's like murders in there. All right. All right, first one out of the gate is Sean Wade. State Pride card. Sean Wade. You're going to guess Saints? Sean Wade is a bird, a raven. I love these state pride cards. We got Trey Sermon. I think he's a patriot. Um, Trey Sermon. I'm going to say no. Uh, I'm going to say patriot. Sermon. I want to say Panthers. Niners. Dang. Uh, so the Baltimore one goes to Jordan. The Niners one goes to Chris. That's 74 out of 99. We got Khalil Herbert, Justin's brother. To 15, Khalil Herbert. Uh, Ravens. Bears for Khalil Herbert. We're not hitting any of these. Steve Wright with his Bears. Nice low number. Steve Wright knows where. No, Steve Wright knows Khalil Herbert. What about Kerry Vincent Jr.? Panther. Sounds like a, a Panther to you? This sounds like a, a Raven to me. Kerry Vincent Jr., Raven. 
Bronco. Oh, that goes to Chris and the Denver Broncos to 25. We know where Najee Harris goes. The bigger names we know. That's for the Steelers. Chris Maxwell with that Steelers trade. And that's that's three out of five. That's a real train whistle. All aboard the Big Head Express. Whoop, whoop. Najee Harris. All right. Am I doing this entire case? Yeah, all 15 boxes of the hog. Okay. Just making sure. That wasn't like a five box. All right. I can't even... I wasn't even close with the animal. I guess Ravens and it was a horse. I gotta get at least the animal. That's still Ravens is a great show, by the way. <laughs> is it? I don't know. <laughs> uh, I was like, I don't think I've thought about that show in like a decade. There's... Tamorian Terry, 8 out of 15. He sounds like a... He's definitely a chief. You think he's a chief? I was going to say... I was going to say a Seahawk. Yes! Oh. Seattle. That goes to uh, Tamorian Terry, Seattle, Robert Flores. Nailed it, Seattle. Right there. What about Cade Johnson? Touchdown King, Cade Johnson. Houston. I'm saying Houston. You're saying Houston? Houston. That sounds like Houston. I agree with you. Whoa! You get the lead and all of a sudden you just you just shadow <laughs> the picks from now on? Fine, fine, fine. I say no, I say he's good. I say he's a Colt. Because that means nobody gets to watch Cade Johnson, a Seahawk <laughs> again. It was right on the screen. It was right on the screen. I don't even look. Seattle, Robert Flores, 17 out of 50. We got State Pride. Pink, Asante Samuel Jr. Chargers. That's right. He's going to be pretty good. Son of, yes, son of the Asante Samuel, if you were wondering. Two out of five, Bolts. John Leon Takianakos. Leon Takianakos. Takianakos. I got to ask Teddy. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Remember he corrected me that one time? He was like, he's like, it's, uh, I, I kept trying it. He's like, yeah, that's the one. I was like, cool. <laughs> Jamar Jefferson. Very flexible. Jamar Jefferson, he, the, the, uh, the, the, the pa Patriot. Saint. Saint Viking. I'm saying Saints. Jamar is a lion, a cat team. That'll be for Stephen K. And Jalen Waddle, of course, is for the Miami Dolphins. Nice autograph, Anthony. It's not as intense when we already know the player where he goes. Reunited and it feels so good. I think it was interesting that they did that with a lot of players too. Yeah, Jamar Chase too. Well, Christian Barrymore. Clavon Chase, Jamar Chase. The dude. Uh, LSU Chase went to went reconnected with Burrow. Yeah. Waddle is with at Etienne with Lawrence. Yeah. Mac Jones got one of the, I think got one of his linemen. So this, this is one of the problems with the type of cases that Leaf yeah. uses right here. They, they, they only started using it this year, too. I think top loader, I think top loader shortage. So they went to these ones? Yeah, I think that's what they had to do. Makes sense. Because usually they're all top loaders. Yeah, you're right. I hate these cases, by the way. There's Carlos Basham Jr. Oh, I feel like I know this. I say I say Saints. Going Buffalo. Seven out of fifteen. Basham is a bill. Nice. Seven out of fifteen for Buffalo. That's going to go to Anthony G. Elijah Mitchell. There was like four different Elijahs picked in the draft this year. Elijah Mitchell. I'm going to say Bears. Elijah, no. <laughs> Elijah Mitchell, a niner. That's going to go to Chris Maxwell. Chuba Hubbard, touchdown Kings. Panthers. Browns. Panthers. Panthers. Ah, good one. He was like the second overall pick in the Canadian Football League. All right. One out of four. Touchdown King. Touchdown! Chris Maxwell with the Panthers. Woo woo! We got Hunter Long. 
Touchdown Kings. Saints. I was going to say Saints too. Colts, for me, is my guess. Hunter Long is a Dolphin. Wow, not even close for any of us. Miami, that'll be for Anthony. And then Travis Etienne, Jaguars. James Teal with this touchdown king. This is a purple parallel, and this is three out of seven. Nice low number on that. All right, next box. Ramondre Stevenson. I'm going to say Browns. Ramondre Stevenson is a Patriot. Not even, we're not even close. The, the, hard, the earlier they are on the box, the harder they are. Though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 20 out of 25. 20 out of 20, that is. Can you grab me some more sleeves? Yeah, yeah. Can I see? Yeah, please. Josh Johnson? Uh, let's say Buccaneers. I'm going to say Browns. Josh Johnson, Seahawk. That'll be for Robert Flores. We got we got a lot of learning to do this summer before the all that NFL product comes out. This is this is the anyway, so. preseason. There's Demonte Coxie. Colts. That's a blue team. Oh. I'm gonna say Colts. I'm gonna say blue team. None on the checklist. So that'll be randomized to someone in the break. Name on top will get it. If I pull another one, second name will get it. The third one goes to the third name, so on and so forth. There's Philippe Franks. Florida team. And <laughs> so where he goes. Let's say Tennessee. Felipe Franks, quarterback. Franks, Falcons. All right, you were closer geographically, I think. This is what it's come down to. We're just going to go regions now. And we got Kadarius Tony. I don't know where he, he I should know where he goes. Giants. Does he go with the Giants? Yeah. Number, he was the one that uh, they ended up having to settle for. Right, 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 right. right, right. Ahead of him. And they wanted Devonta Smith. This is two out of two. Giants. Sean O'Leary. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. All right. What about... Rico Bussy Jr. Busey Jr. Jets. Well, he's in Jets colors. You think he went to the same color team? I say he's a. Uh, and he looks. He looks like a like a a Texan to me. Rico Busey Jr. is a Steeler. That's Chris Maxwell. Got the Steelers in the trade. Uh, to 25. Uh, Gary's nephew, Busey. Corey, what's going on? Well, I'm doing terrible right now because I'm not, I'm not doing very well at knowing where any of these players go. Marquez, Marquez, Marquez Stevenson. Steeler. Brown. Bills. Anthony G. I'm not even close. Quiddy Pay. Colts. Colts? Yeah. Wow, that was pretty confident. I see a cat team. Oh, he's Colts for sure. One of my favorite stories. All right, he's a Colt. From the, the draft. Why? Uh, dude's from, like, Senegal or whatever. Seven out of seven. Nice. He's a badass. Oh, nice. All right, so Andrew. with Andrew S. with the Colts. 
And there's Amari Rogers. Three out of five, Amari Rogers. I'm going to go... I'm going to go... Uh, New York team. You're going to go New York team? I'm going to go Niners on this. Amari Rogers, Packers. Oh, right. That's how you'll know. Aaron's brother. Aaron's brother, Amari. Uh, Sean O'Leary with the Packers. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Sometimes you have to use these weird mnemonics to try to... All right, Travis Etienne Jaguars. James Teal, nice one. Maybe we'll find him, the person that will throw or hand him, hand the ball off to him. Three out of seven. Uh, he's been lining up in the slot. We'll find the person, maybe we'll find the person that throws the ball to him. They can't use him in the slot all the time, are they? It sounds like it. But then, then what, James Robinson will get all the carries? And... That's interesting. I like Leaf Metal Draft. This is, all, this is always one of my favorite sort of preseason products. Summertime football products, the draft products. Oh, see, they use those cases and these just get... Thankfully, the best hits are usually on the bottom. So... Apology with my apologies and respect to Rashad Verner or Weaver here. Yeah, it's true. It's a double and a home run for him. Already today? Yeah, they they, they, they had like back to back to back home runs. Someone was saying in the chat. Tenacious D, Rashad Weaver, Jared's brother. Luke's brother. 21 out of 75. I say Anaheim Rams as well. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Titans. Oh. Anthony with the Titans. Got that in a trade. Don't put that city in that name. Yeah, Tenacious D. Uh, Christian Barmore. That's Patriots. No. Yes. That's Niners. 100% Patriots. Tenacious D. Barmore. He was a second round pick. Patriots. <laughs> 10 out of 10. I feel like Sean's pulling away from, from me here in the lead. There's Asim Rose Jr., a, uh, a, an Arizona football cardinal for sure. Houston. 19 out of 60. 1960. Rose Jr. is a Viking. Not even close. <laughs> Minnesota. That goes to Jonathan Liang. Patrick Jones the second, the Bengal. Right? I keep thinking of Patrick Sertain. That's uh, what's because he's also Pat Sertain's also a second. Patrick Sertain is Bronco, though. Um, Viking again. Oh! Jones Vikings. There you go. There we go. Vikings. What about Javante Williams? Oh, I should know Javante Williams. Packers. Pack yeah. Broncos. Dang. 56 out of 75. Denver, my rivals. That goes to Chris Maxwell. I know. I, I get more of that right. I get more of it right if I say who they're not on. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not this team. Jason Owe, definitely not a charger. Well, who is he not? Cleveland. Not Cleveland, not Chargers. Because <laughs> he's a Raven. That'll be for Jordan K with Baltimore. KJ Elvis Costello. Okay, so on the list, I already saw it. He's none. He is on the checklist. But the checklist says none. He's none on the checklist. So that'll go to the second name on the randomizer. State pride card, J.C. Horn. Beep, beep. 
Carolina, no, you, sorry, Carolina. Yeah, I was going to say, you're thinking of the of, of Joe Horn. There's 24 out of 25. J.C. Horn is a Carolina Panther. He's out of South Carolina. He's stayed in Carolina. Kellen Mond. Uh, Minnesota Vikings. Yeah, I think you're right. Kellen Mond is a Minnesota Viking. That'll be for Jonathan Liang. 53 out of 75. And a Zach Wilson. Chris Maxwell getting the Zach Wilson in the trade. There was a Bears-Jets trade. Chris Maxwell, wow. Jets fan. And then Steve Wright, Bears fan. They had each other's teams. Wow. So they switched them up. Nice, Chris. So Chris gets the three out of three Zach Wilson. One, two, three. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Now we now we just need to get Steve Wright. No, it's only fair we get a Fields. Get a Justin Fields, and those two guys get their quarterback PCs. Do you think there's gonna be a premium on Fields field levels this year? Oh, and a select football. Right. Yeah. Field field levels. I would love that. Look at this crazy lady just dragging her home run with a Prius. Prius doesn't that have that kind of hauling power. No, it doesn't have that torque. Hmm. I mean, it's got good torque, but... Not the towing capacity, though. No. No. There's Terrence Marshall Jr. Uh, he, he's a... He's, uh, He's a brown. He's a brown. He's a panther. Carolina, that'll be for Chris. 10 out of 25 on that state pride card. One of my favorite cards. Jabril Cox. Colts. You think this Cox goes to the Colts? Two out of 15. I say Jabril Cox goes to... The Buccaneers. Cowboys. Dang it. Anthony G with this Cox. Jabril Cox, that is. We got Seth Williams. The Arizona football cardinal, Seth Williams. Right? <laughs> Seth Williams, another Bronco. No, that, that Jabril Cox wasn't one of the biggest Cox we've seen. We've seen some lower numbered ones. Remember the Long Cox duel? Yes, there was that Long the Cox long dual Cox autograph. Yeah. One. One. Sam Ellinger. He is a giant. Saint. Saint? Colt. Colt. Why did why did they get why did I they draft was, a quarterback? I was so confident in that one too. Yeah, you were, you were. That goes to Andrew S. And Jamar Chase, of course, goes to the Bengals. Like we're not excited about the good hits. <laughs> like we're living and dying with all like the round five, six picks. This is a great one. Jamar Chase. Hopefully we'll hear Burrow to Chase all season long. That'll be for Anthony G. I was so confident in that one. You were, you were. Like, if that was, like, a daily double, I would have... You would have doubled? I would have doubled. I'm not getting another... Yeah. Wait, hold on. I have 25 in this. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Yeah, I'm not going to make it. All right. I don't know why Mike and Brian are laughing. We but Jabril Cox. Some people are gonna rewatch this and be like, "These guys are absolute idiots." Like, yeah, 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 yeah. For absolutely. Sure. For sure. Absolutely. Remember, this is this is June eleventh, twenty twenty one. We don't know any of these guys. <laughs> you know, like one of like this random dude is gonna be a Hall of Famer, and like Jabril Cox will be like a Pro Bowler, and we're like, wherever. Where does he go? Who knows? Who cares? This is like uh, this is like Justin Herbert last summer. I would say more like Giannis. 
first year. All right, more like first year Giannis. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. So like, yeah, yeah, Giannis Antetokounmpo. Yeah, whatever, Giannis Antetokounmpo, oh. Antetokounmpo, however you say his name. Never going to play. Ne- <laughs> never going never gonna to need to learn his name. Won't get a second contract. Yeah. Won't need to learn Giannis's name. <laughs> not good, not good, not going to work here anymore. Cornell Powell, PC load letter. Uh, Cornell Powell. That's a uh, 10 out of 10. A, uh, an eagle for sure. Fly like an eagle. Saints. So the Saints have to be on this list, right? Chiefs. Dang. <laughs> That'll be for Jonathan Liang who got the Chiefs in a trade. What about Dylan Moses? Leading people out of the wilderness. Leading people... This is one out of 20. Dylan Moses. He seems like a patriot. Is an eagle. Seems like a patriot. Is a jaguar. That'll be for James Teal. We got Ben Skoronek. Skoronek. Uh, Bears. Skoronek is a uh, a buccaneer. The Bears, the Bears, the Bears, the Bears, the Bears. Rams. Aaron Billingsley with the Rams, 17 out of 50. Oh, I don't know. TJ Vasher? I should know where he goes. Saints. You say Saints? I say TJ Vasher is a Niner. Vasher is a Cowboy. Not, we're not, not even close. Anthony G. This might be our worst box. This is, this is the last few boxes have been pretty bad. Trey Lance. 49 Niners. Chris Maxwell with the Trey Lance. He got that in a different trade. Chris Maxwell was a trading machine. We're Five gonna, out of ten. We're going to run out of these post-it notes. Are we going to run out of post-it notes? Yes. Do we have more minis? Oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. It's in this container here. Okay, cool. You want to go with pink this time? Yeah, that works. Maybe that'll bring us better luck. Yeah. Why, Corey, why is college autos worse less than NFL autos? Eh. I mean, people end up liking the pro uniforms more at the end of the day. Probably more fans of a call of a NFL franchise than like a college. That's true, but at the same point, I know I know people that like legit uh, Justin Clement, who buys. LSU That's true. Stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He only it's buys true. LSU stuff. Like he just, he's like, I don't care about OBJ, like Browns edition. You know what I mean? Right. He's like, but I don't know if there's that many collectors like that though. I mean, as Ohio, not not as many. Ohio State. Thing. That's true. Yeah. Like I mean, you gotta think of those those colleges that like actually love what they like their college. There's Nico Collins, a Cleveland Brown. I just have to say it confidently enough. Colts. Cleveland Browns. Texan. Nico Collins, yeah! a Texan. Oh, nice, good change, good reverse on that one out of twenty-five. That'll be for Kyle Bloomberg. Oh, this is my proudest moment. What about 46 out of 50, Killian Hill? Killian high upon a hill. I'm going to go Cowboys. I'm going to go Dolphins. I'm going to stay in the state of Texas. Killian Hill is a Packer. Green Bay, that'll be for Sean O. What about, what about Elon Musk's wife, Grimes? R.L. Grimes? No, no, that's a different Grimes. Are there really three, two different Grimes yeah, out there? There's Arla there Grimes and Grimes. Yeah. And now we got Trayvon Grimes out uh, in pop culture world? Where does Trayvon Grimes go? I'm going to go with uh, Rams. Grimes' first record is actually pretty good. Uh, I'm going to say Jaguars. Eagles. That's Daniel with Trayvon Grimes. What about Tenacious D, 52 out of 75? Uh, Tetterell Slayton. Tetterell? Tetterell Slayton. Tedarell. I'm going to say Tedarell. Yeah, I'll go with Tedarell as well. Tedarell Slayton. <laughs> Tetterell sounds even better than that. Tetterell. I, I, just, I just saw like Adderall right here. I was, I, I was going to say Ted Adderall. Uh, Tedarell Slayton. I'm going to say... Panther. Panther. Well, he's not an eagle or a falcon. That's on our list right here. I'm going to say Rams. 
Packers. Dang. Sean O'Leary. Listen, I'm not doing good, but I don't think you've gotten anything. I've, yeah, no, one. no, I don't think I've gotten you any. Have, you had a one O lead. I don't even know where Elijah Moore goes. You had a one O lead, and then like it's it's. It was just it's yeah, it's been squander. one in like 25 yeah. from, from here on. Yeah, it's not good. Um, Panthers. Elijah Moore, Patriots, Cardinals. No, that's Rondell Moore. Jets for Elijah Moore. Man. That's for Chris Maxwell on the Jets. What an embarrassing performance here for me. All right. We're two thirds of the way through. Last five boxes, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. Why can't there be like Alex Leatherwoods and Trayvon Moorings and Divine Diablos? There's Jamie Newman. Wait, is Leatherwood the guy you overdrafted? No. He's the guy we drafted right where we wanted to. Jamie Newman, four out of five. Train whistle, Jamie Newman. Patriots. Patriots, I say Steelers. Newman. Is an eagle. I got the state. <laughs> Four out of five. Uh, Philadelphia, Daniel Lyman, all aboard the Big Head Express. Woo -woo. We got Javon Holland, Tom's brother. Spider Man. Five out of ten. Uh, Javon Holland is definitely not a lion because he's a dolphin. Whoa! Boom! Wow! Got it. That is <laughs> five out of two. ten. <laughs> Miami, I got two now. Two out of like thirty. Anthony with the dolphins. Oh, it's a lot more than that. I think so. I think it's like forty. Well, you gotta think. We've done this is this is the eleventh box times five. Fifty. <laughs> yeah, it's probably like one out of like forty-nine, right? Yeah. Well, what about Pat Fryermuth? Steelers, second round pick. Wow, that's pretty confident. I'm saying Colts. Steelers, I already know. <laughs> he went to Penn State, tight end. Yeah, he went. Yeah. Steelers, that's going to go to Chris Maxwell and the Steelers 25. What about Michael Carter? Bronco, or no, sorry, Cowboys, I'm going to say. You're going to say Cowboys? Michael Carter is a Viking. Turn off the open sign after this. I just reminded you. Jets. Michael Carter. Chris Maxwell on his Jets. And we got Rashad Patrick Bateman. Ah, oh, come on. This is a... I know, either this, this, this is compelling TV no, here. Um, Seahawks, Seahawks, Seahawks. We'll go Bills. Ravens. It was a bird team. I had bird on the brand. I have a bird brain. Jordan with the Ravens. All right, we're, all, we're almost done, folks. I know, that's why I was like, I feel like I should know this player. I don't know, maybe. Drafting all Raiders this year. They'll be the number. They'll be like the number six offense in the league. What are you talking about? Uh, oh my god! They'll be the number six offense. They'll be top ten offense in the league. They were. They were top, almost top ten last year. Yeah, no. Totally. They're gonna be a top five offense this year. They're so good. Raiders top five offense this year. Lock it in. You heard it here first, folks. There's Dwayne Eskridge, a Colt. Out of 15. Same. A Seahawk. <laughs> 10 out of 15. This is terrible. <laughs> Steve the other night was like, he was like, lock it in. Bears, uh, I forget who he called for the Super Bowl. And I was like, Steve, didn't you call the Bears Super Bowl last year? He goes, shut your mouth. <laughs> I was like, okay, cool. Just There's Amir Smith-Marset. State Pride card, 9 out of 30. Panther. Marset 
is a uh, giant. Viking. A, a giant Viking is what I meant to say. Nine out of 30. That'll be for Minnesota, Jonathan Liang. What about Zaven Collins? Zaven Collins is a giant. Nelson Aguilar? You should expect him to be happy to be out of the Raiders organization. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't want losers anyway. I say Giants. You say Saints? I don't even know who name. Collins? Cardinals. Collins, Card Cardinal Collins. That'll be for Chris Maxwell and the Arizona Football Cardinals. What about Jalen Twyman? Browns. Tenacious D, Jalen Twyman. Now, he is a buccaneer, my friend. He is a Viking. Eight out of ten, that is another Viking for Jonathan Liang. And Corey was asking earlier, have I pulled a Trevor Lawrence? Yes. Trevor Lawrence! Anthony, good Wyatt with the good hit. Cincinnati Bengals. Jaguars, sorry. <laughs> Losing my mind here. James Teal with the Jaguars. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just calling so many different teams, I'm all messed up. Sorry, Anthony. James Teal. James Teal's like freaking out. He's like, what the F? That's He's mine. Like, whoa. Like, whoa, 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 that's mine. All aboard the Big Head Express. Whoop, whoop. I got too many teams mixed up in my head right now. And it's an out of five. All right, I gotta get I gotta get one more of these guys. I couldn't even get Trevor Lawrence. <sighs> All right, fifteen more autographs to go. Fifteen more opportunities for me to try to guess one of these guys. All right, what about? Joseph Osai and a plate. That's a Colt, Joseph Osai. You're gonna go Browns? That's uh, 32 out of 40. Bangles. There's the Bangles, Anthony. 32 out of 40. The plate auto is gonna be Ramondre Stevenson. We just had him. Damn. <laughs> Well, was it Seahawks? Seahawks? Yeah, was it Seahawks? Bill. No, that's Marquez Stevenson. That's Jacoby Stevenson. Ramondre Stevenson, Patriots. Damn. Sean Robinson with the Pats. Poor short-term memory here, too. There, there's Tariq Black. Wasn't he a basketball player for the Lakers? I say the Lions. I say that's three out of seven. I say a Seahawk. Tariq Black is a Colt. That's going to be Andrew. We got a Chris Evans State Pride card. Isn't he in uh, what movie is he? Avengers. He's in Avengers. Do, 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 do. 26 out of 99. Rams. Chris Evans is, he's an Avenger, right? So he would be like an eagle, like a patriotic eagle. He is a patriotic bangle. That goes to Anthony in Cincinnati. And Kyle Pitts, of course, goes to the Falcons. Andrew Semain with oh, Atlanta. Atlanta. D-A-T-L, an Atlantean. Other than the zoo, do you think there's actually Falcons in Atlanta? Yeah. In Atlanta? Oh, no. Maybe in, I was going to say Georgia for sure. Right. But in the city of Atlanta, in that urban landscape, maybe in surrounding areas, you're saying the actual city of Atlanta. Look at that. Just so inspired by being on a good team. Albert Pujols, 10th home run of the year. Nine with the Dodgers. I don't know if it's nine with the Dodgers. I think it's five with the Dodgers. All, all ten with the Dodgers just didn't feel like hitting home runs with the Angels. Just rejuvenated. Look at him. Look at him sp spryly sprinting around the bases, just carrying that old dad bot around. Steroids? Is that what you... 
joined the Dodgers and just started roiding up. Yeah, all, all those baseballs that the Dodgers have been barreling this year. <laughs> yeah. Dodgers are using steroids. I don't know why Mookie Betts isn't hitting. Oh, through the five hole. I know, Jesse. I can't get can't get all Sean twisted with all that pool holes talk. Hey, you still have a personal con. He's still going to work for you guys for 10 years after he retires. <laughs> Paul Sina. No, he's coming. going to work back. With, he, after he got released, he's going to go to work for uh, Artie Moreno on the personal services contract. I don't listen, know what that means. Listen, you want to be grumpy because like, is he, you're going to play off the bench. Is he getting, coffee for, he's getting same, coffee for interns or something like that? the same role for somebody else. Like, what's going on? <laughs> I use all the regulars. You gave me a regular and a 55. Come on, Sean. Well, it was in I'm just trying regular. to run a smooth break here. It was in the regular bin. I can't even get guesses. Oh, then come on. Look, Did look, Jesse then. Look, it's full. <laughs> I didn't pull it from there. That's 55. I don't know. I think you magically got it from somewhere. I blame Sean. I can't blame Jesse. I blame Sean. Look, Jesse. I'm blaming Sean. Two out of seven. Paulson Adebo. Cardinal. Adebo is a Saint for Whoa, sure. Nice, Sean. Nice, nice, nice. Um, Saints, that'll be for Chris with the Saints. What about Saints, like, what about Javian Hawkins? I think Javian Hawkins is a Falcon because I made the I made a Falcon Hawk joke. What about a chicken hawk joke? I did not make a chicken hawk joke. Javian Hawkins to 75. Do you have a guess? Hawkins is a falcon. Wow. Ka -ka, ka -ka. Wow. Ka -ka. Oh, Jesse only talked 100s and 130s today. I blame Sean, Jesse. I knew it wasn't you. I'm sorry, man. I shouldn't even blame you in the first place. All right. Stevie Scott the third. Stevie Scott the third. State Pride card. Panthers. 16 out of 19 out of 60. Texan. I say he's a Titan. C.V. Scott is a Bangle. That'll be for Anthony. State pride cards are really sharp. We got Sage Surratt. K. Surratt, Surratt. Whatever will be, will be. The future is mine, you see. K. Surratt, Surratt. One out of ten, Surratt is a giant. Is a lion. Nice. Good job, Sean Jaspi. That's for Stephen K. Oh. Come on, 55s. The same 55s that jammed me up. Oh, boy. It's falling all over the place. All right. And then we got a plate. Armed and dangerous, Justin Fields. Whoa! Steve Wright. That trade balancing out. One of one. One of one, Justin Field, armed and dangerous, plate and autograph. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Now you one up a, a three out of three, or a one out of three, Zach yeah, Wilson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One of one, Justin That's how you Field. one up a three out of three, Zach Wilson. There you go, nice. You know, uh, Dick Sporting Goods said that Justin Fields is one of the top selling jerseys. Already. Chicago is so desperate to finally have a good quarterback. Mm -hmm. This is stupid. Maybe it is where it's. I told you. <laughs> Who's that nobody that hit home run? Will Smith, the fresh <laughs> Prince of Bel Air? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Put some respect on his name. All right, and the final box. Thanks, everyone, for gathering with us and making this break happen. There's Javon McKinley, and thanks to Sean. So this break would have actually gone faster if I didn't have Sean helping me write down all these hits, and the shipping team will definitely thank us for that, too. 18 out of 35, Javon McKinley. Cardinal. Cardinal, Washington football team. Lion. <laughs> 
kind of disappointed in him. All right, I know, right? Stephen Kendrick with Detroit. We've got a lot of learning to do over the summer, folks. What about Grady White? Armed and, armed and dangerous Grady White. What? Rethink that. That's a quarterback right there. Why would they draft a quarterback? Well, I didn't, I, I didn't know it was Look a quarterback. Look at the picture. I didn't know it was a quarterback. Um, I'll give you another chance. Six out of seven. I say he went to... Seattle. Oh, I was going to say that. Um, I'm going to say Saints. Brady White, uh, none. None. Brady none. White, none. I saw it right there. Oh, you saw it. Yeah. All right, so that goes to the third name on the randomizer. First name, second name, third name. These are all none on the checklist. What about Tyler Vons from USC? Lions. Tyler Vons. No, sorry, Colts. Uh, shit, I don't know. No, I say Panthers. he went to the... That's five out of seven. Colts. He went to the Washington football team. Colts. Colts, nice. Yeah. Wow. So they got two USC receivers out there. Andrew. Got Pittman and this guy. Or I don't know if he plays receiver, but he looks like he's running. Uh, I think he's played receiver. There's Warren Jackson. I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. Ooh, I am for real. Warren Jackson is not a Panther. 16 out of 20. Everyone knows that oh, Warren Eagle. Jackson is a Titan. Eagle. Eagle. Warren Jackson is a Bronco. Denver. Chris Maxwell. This, this, is very, this is embarrassing. And Kyle Trask for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. That's going to go to Anthony. Got the Buccaneers in a trade. And that's out of 10. Anthony, thank you. Thanks, Sean. Thanks, everybody. We'll, yeah, we'll do a quick recap of all those metal cards at the end right here, too. If anybody too. gets bored, tally up our wins. No, don't tally up. Tally don't don't up. waste your time. Don't, I want to know. Don't tally up the wins. No, I crushed it. You've got, no. you've got more to do in life. Uh, we were like 90% wrong anyway. Chris, down to Jonathan and everybody in between. So the top three will get autographs. So that's top three after 11. Come on. This break's long enough. 11 times? One. Two, three, four, five, six. And 11th and final time. After 11 times. So, Andrew, you'll get the third card that we pulled. Anthony with the second one, and Jonathan Liang with the first one. So, Jonathan with the DeMonte Coxie. KJ Costello will be for Anthony and Brady White out of seven for Andrew Semaine. Here is the recap right here. R -r 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 recap. All right, so we're just gonna show you the names, the teams we have, we have listed on the backs right there. So they'll go to the right places. Terry K. Johnson. All right, Asante Samuel, Jamar Jefferson, Jalen Waddell, Basham, Mitchell, Hubbard, Long. So we, we pulled a lot of nice stuff out of here. Franks, Busey, all right, Etienne, Weaver, Barmore, Patrick Jones, the State Pride cards, J.C. Horn. We got the Zach Wilson was really sharp. That was three out of three. Jabril Cox. Jamar, this Cornell Powell, Dylan Moss. We got Skoronek. Trey Lance was really cool too. That Trey Lance was five out of 10. Nice cracked ice pattern there. Nico Collins, Grimes, Slayton, so on and so forth. Michael Carter, Bateman, Eskridge, Twyman, Trevor Lawrence. One out of five was really nice. All those top quarterbacks were train whistle hits. The, yeah. the Zach, except for the Trey Lance, maybe. But but yeah, I mean, that's that's really nice. There you go. Ramondre Stevenson. Well, we literally hit every Tariq single one except for Mac Jones. Wow, right. You're and right, he actually. Was the, yeah. Like, let's be honest. He's the, the 15th overall. Yeah. And the rest of them were top four, so. There's the Justin Fields plate and autograph for the Bears. And we ended it with Kyle Trask. We got Kyle Trask. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was our 2021 Leaf Medal and 2020 Plates and Patches dual case break.
thanks everyone for watching and breaking this with us on a Friday. We appreciate it. I'm Joe. Thanks to Sean for helping me out as well. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.